what's up you guys welcome back to my channel today I have my Sephora VIB sale haul it is a bit late but I was actually sick I had well not sick I had my tonsils removed so I was I was not able to talk very well I did actually I filmed a video like two days after I got my tonsils out and I had to completely scrap it because I just sounded so weird and just I wasn't I wasn't in good shape after filming that video. I passed out for like three hours. So I scrapped that video, um, but I'm back again. I, if you haven't seen this, I think this one's going up on Monday or Tuesday. So on Sunday, I put up my giveaway video. So it's a giveaway for my 21st birthday and also Christmas. Um, I turned 21 on the, the 22nd, so depending on when I get this video up, it could have already happened, it could um, be happening soon or today or whatever. Um, but yeah, so I have that giveaway going. If you wanna see that video, I am gonna link it down below for you guys. Feel free to enter, there's a lot of really good stuff in there. And yeah, so without me rambling any further, let's get into what I bought during the VIB sale. I also got some Morphe Dose of Colors and my BoxyCharm that I'm gonna show you guys too. So it's just like a big haul unboxing thing for you guys. So I'm gonna go in order of when I like place these orders. So Morphe is gonna be first. And I was so, so excited to get these things. I Well, first the first thing I got was the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. This is my favorite setting spray of all time. It's better than any one I have ever tried. So I had to restock on this. I also put one of these in the giveaway. So if you want to win one of these, go enter that giveaway. <laughs> And also, one of the next things in there as well, and that is the Dare to Create palette. This is brand new from Morphe, launched for holiday. I think James Charles was the face of it, but this is, oh, this is so cute. I didn't even say, I didn't even know what it said. It says, be your own muse, we dare you. This is awesome. That is so cute. The packaging is so sleek. And this, the color story of this palette is absolutely amazing. Um, you've got your everyday transitions. You've got your, you've got your more purple shades. You've got your natural shades. You've got blues and greens and you got a black and it's just everything you can want. And I shot a palette right here. Like I said that with the Jaclyn Hill palette, which I do still believe. I love, love, love the Jaclyn Hill palette. But these, this is amazing. <laughs> this is something I would definitely use, especially when I'm do make, doing makeup on a client or something like that. Um, it's, it's just so, so pretty and there's everything I could possibly need in here. Let's swatch a few of them. <coughs> um, I think I'm gonna swatch this shade right here. I don't know if it'll focus, but I'm gonna swatch this shade right there and the one right below it and then like this blue. So that's the blue, that's really, really pretty. We've got the matte purpley shade. And then we've got like an orangey. Oh my gosh, those are so pigmented, you guys. Like, so, so pigmented. Wow, that's, that's amazing. That was literally just me barely rubbing my finger in it. That's really, really pretty. If you wanna win one of those, go enter my giveaway. This is an amazing palette. I am obsessed already. Next, I ordered from Dose of Colors. And I got these two sets right here. These are $29 a piece. Actually, oh wait. I forgot how much both of my Morphe things were. I'll try to find it and put it in the description box for you guys. These I got from Dose of Colors. They were $29 each. I actually ordered them off of Ulta because they went on there first. Um, but you guys, these sets are amazing. If you can get your hands on them, please do. Dose of Colors is an amazing, amazing lipstick line or liquid lipstick line. And these are the nudes. This one's called The Snuggle is Real. So that's super cute. You get three nude shades in this. Um, they're like, I it's really hard for me to find nude shades that work for me because I am so pale. Um, so I'm really hoping some of these work. Um, this one, I'm going to swatch them all for you too. This one is the shade Let's Cuddle. It's a super like beigey nude, I would say. It's got a little bit of a peach in it as well. I just have it right there. Yeah, I really like that shade. I don't know if I can pull that off with my skin tone, but I'm gonna try, like I always try. Um, and normally these are like $18 a piece, so getting three for 29 is an insanely good deal. This one, oh, sorry. 
<laughs> this one is the shade Lazy Daisy. And if you guys want like a lip swatch video on these, I can totally do that. Um, I'm just going to let you know now that I have a cold sore. And so I can't swatch anything on my lips right now. So if you want one, I will do one in the future. And that one's Lazy Daisy. Super pretty. Alright. Next up we've got Warm Fuzz- Warm and Fuzzy. I was going to say Warm Fuzzy is a weird name. Warm and Fuzzy. Super, super pretty shade. This is something I would wear on a daily basis. It's just a more of a pinky tone. That one's really pretty. Real pretty. Alright, so that was the Snuggles Real set. And then next we have the Holibay set. Now these are amazing. I love red lipstick. I wear red lipstick on the daily. Um, they're so, so good. And so you get a little bit of a, you get like I think a, a blue red and then a pinky red and then a deep like brick red. And so I'm really, really excited to swatch these. Get out. This one is the shade Bittersweet. And I find that these are pretty true to color when you see them through the tube. Oh yeah, that one's like really pretty. That's like your classic red. There's a little bit of an orange undertone to it, but super, super pretty. Well, I need to like work on my swatching. I always slant that way. <laughs> Alright, the next one is the more pinky red shade, and this one's called Strawberry Pop. Super pretty. Oh yeah, that's beautiful. That is gorgeous. Okay, I went the wrong way with it. <laughs> this one is that shade right there on the bottom. It's super, super pretty. I really like that as well. I like all of these really well. But that's how I am in life. I tend to not like... Like, I'm not really picky, so I tend to like, like, everything when it comes to makeup. Um, this one is called Extra Saucy. Oh, cute. I love that name. And that's the shade there. And I love the packaging and the applicator on these. It's a doe foot, but it's got a little dip in it, and it just forms to your lip really well, which I really, really like. I'm going to do like a double swatch of this. Um, this one is more of a berry tone, which I do like. I don't wear as often, but it's really, really pretty nonetheless. Um, wow, I'm just getting worse and worse with these swatches, so I completely apologize, but that is alright. You'll just have to accept me for how I am. It's that one on the bottom there. It's really berry toned and really, really pretty. I have a hard time pulling those off sometimes, but I am definitely going to attempt. So yeah, those are those two sets. Super pretty, super worth the money. The Dose of Colors formula is absolutely amazing. Um, it lasts very, very long. <coughs> I honestly have nothing bad to say about it. I used to have the shade Stone, and that was like the lipstick I would wear every single day of my life, and then it broke, and I never got around to buying it again, so I might have to do that soon. So now move into what I got at Sephora on the VIB sale. I am now VIB Rouge, so I'm super excited about that. I, it's taken me a while to get there. <laughs> um, but I kind of just bought things that I had wanted for a really long time that I wasn't like ever going to let myself buy because I thought they were too expensive. So um, I got to kind of splurge on this VIB sale and I'm super, super excited about it. Um, the first thing I purchased was the Tatcha Dewy Luminous Skin Mist. Now this is something that is super, super popular on YouTube. It's an amazing setting mist and I already really, really love it so I can see why there's so much hype around it. Um, I will list all the prices of, every, of everything in the description box below because I just always forget the prices and I have to look it up. But this is really, really amazing and worth the money. Next thing I got was another Glam Glow mask. I have the Gravity Mud mask besides this one, but this is the Thirsty Mud mask. I, if you don't know, I have insanely dry skin and especially in winter I'll get eczema spots on my face. Um, so I really wanted something that was going to hydrate my skin really, really well. Um, this is cute. It says, hello sexy when you open it up. That's kind of funny. Um, but it just looks like this. It's super, a super nice one. I have heard great things about it, so I'm going to put it to the test. If you want a video on Glam Glow masks, 
I can totally do that for you because I've tried out a couple of them. Um, so yeah, let me know if the, in the comments down below if you want to see a video on these little babies. Super excited about that. Next up, we've got a primer from Marc Jacobs. This is their hydrating coconut primer. I think it's called Invisible Undercover Perfecting Coconut Face Primer. So that's a really long name, but this is just coconut face primer that's hydrating. Basically, I really, really love it already. It's very similar to the Too Faced Hangover Primer, but I do like this better because it's a little less sticky. I mean, sometimes sticky is good. You want your foundation to hold on, but this hydrates a little bit more, so I really, really like it. All right, and then I got the Dew Drops from Marc Jacobs. What this is basically just like a liquid highlighter um, that you can mix in with your foundation or pay on top. I put it on my legs and on my collarbones at a wedding I went to, and I really, really liked how it went. So, yeah, this stuff is amazing. I'm not going to swatch it because it gets glitter all over me for the rest of the day. Um, so be warned about that, but it's still really, really, really good. Next up, I got a bronzer from Hourglass. I haven't had anything from Hourglass before, so I was super excited to get this. This is what it looks like. It's not like super, super exciting when you look at it in the pan, but it just adds a, like, a level of like luminosity to your cheeks. That's just really, really pretty. It just looks like that. It's really, really subtle, so you can go heavy-handed with it, and I really, really have been enjoying it so far. I've tried out everything already, so... Couldn't help myself, sorry. <laughs> Next, I got another thing from Marc Jacobs, which is one of their blushes. I have been looking at these blushes for literally since they came out. I've been obsessed with them, and I've wanted one so bad. This is the shade Kink and Kisses. It's super pretty, just a nice peachy pink shade. I am obsessed already, of course. Oh, I'm so excited about the next thing, you guys. <laughs> Next, I got the Natasha Denona um, Sunset Palette. I have been wanting this for a hot minute. I've already used it a ton, but look at how gorgeous that is. It is absolutely beautiful. I, I am obsessed with warm tone um, eyeshadows, so this palette is perfect for me. The first time I saw it was in Las Vegas, and I almost screamed in the Sephora I was in. <laughs> So when I saw that it was in my store, I just, I couldn't believe it because my store doesn't get anything like high end like that. We don't have like, I mean, we have Marc Jacobs and Hourglass, but we don't have YSL, we don't have Armani, we don't have anything like that. So when I saw that this was there, I was so excited and I could not help myself, so I bought it. And I'm super, super excited. This palette runs for $129, so that's crazy. But I got it for 20% off, obviously, so I am obsessed with it. I do not regret this purchase one bit. It's absolutely amazing, and I will live with this palette for the rest of my life. Even if I hit pan, I'm keeping the palette. <laughs> last but not least, I actually bought this at Yonkers like before my last day. Um, it's the Lancome Tint Idol Ultra Wear Foundation. I already went through one bottle of this. This is an amazing, amazing foundation. I am absolutely obsessed. Um, I'm in the shade 100N, I believe. Yeah, 100 Ivory N. And this is just a really good full coverage. If you want your skin to look, like, perfect, get this stuff. It's amazing. And then I also did buy a Double Wear um, foundation, but I just forgot it at my house. And I'm at my parents' house filming, so sorry about that. I got double wear in the shade 1N1. And if you didn't know, I used to work for Estee Lauder as their counter manager at our Yonkers store. Um, so, yeah, I am obsessed with Estee Lauder purchase uh, products. Products. All right, so that's all I got from, like, Yonkers, Sephora, Morphe, Dose. I also have my BoxyCharm here. I'm going to go through it quick. Actually... I don't have everything that came in it with me because I put it in my giveaway. Um, so this is the card. This uh, month's theme was sweater weather. I love getting these. It's, it's just such a good deal. Um, I, you also got a Luxie Beauty Quad Eye Travel Set in this and a Cover Effects Illuminating Spray, but I put both of those in my giveaway. So if you want those, go enter on, um, on that other video. Um, but then we get, did get three other things in here too, which I think this box had a really, really good value this week, or this month. The first thing in here is this Winky Luxe eyeshadow palette. 
Um, these are really pretty colors. Uh, some of them I wouldn't really use, but this is a really pretty eyeshadow palette, so I'm going to keep it. Um, if I don't keep it, I'll give it to my little sister. That's just what I do with these palettes. So yeah, this one's really, really pretty. This one retails for $25. So if you want to pick it up for yourself, go ahead. Next, I've got a... What is that? Lacka. Lacka. Lacker. Lacka. It's L-A-Q-A and Co. Cloud Lips. And this is $17. It's an airy matte lipstick that's full coverage, which I haven't really seen anything like this. Like, it's it's like I don't wear like regular lipstick very often at all. That doesn't look matte to me. It's right there on the side of my hand. It's a nice deep berry shade. It's pretty, but I don't really like lipsticks, so I'm gonna give it to like my sister. I think she gonna get a lot of makeup. <laughs> and then, oh, I'm super excited about these, actually. I've been looking for, like, things like these for forever. This is from KNC Beauty, and they're collagen lip masks. In the box, you get three of them. Um, so, I'm super excited to try these. I have seen these on, like, Instagram and stuff, so, and they always look really cool. So, I'm excited to try them out for myself. But yeah, that's all I have for this haul. It's, it was a really big one. I haven't done one in a very long time. So if you want more hauls, let me know in the comment box down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.